What's going on, everybody? Welcome back. Today, we're going to do some Commander here uh, with a Joyra list, courtesy of Ash. And uh, before that, guys, we're going to finish this, the Ballad of Michael B. The fanfic. This is the part, the third part of the fanfic written by Kerwit. If you, if you, uh, if you remember, we last left with Mike and Bortina, and they were dating. <laughs> so right now, he got a job with uh, Hungry Howie himself, and uh, Hungry Howie said, "I like your moxie. You're working for me now." And uh, he traveled a lot. And now the next chapter, Florida man. On a sunny July afternoon, Bortina and I left on a trip to Florida. It was a place that I had always wanted to visit. It seemed like a quaint place with old-time values. The flight was uneventful. <laughs> the flight was uneventful, and after landing and checking into a motel, we went out to sightsee. We walked around the small town we had decided to stay in. I don't recall its name, as Bortina had booked it. The town was folksy, real folksy, which is, I supposed, what we had come for. It was the kind of town that had one main street and all the stores were on it. There was a high school at the end of the main drag and since school was out, teenagers in trucks driving all over the place. <laughs> this is more Midwestern than Florida. At this point, I saw what was perhaps the strangest thing I've ever seen. A man came running out of a store followed closely by an alligator in a hot dog costume and a dog on a 4x4. I... <laughs> oh, Jesus. I didn't really have time to contemplate the deep meaning of this truly bizarre occurrence as the group of them swerved sharply and headed straight at us. I dove to get out of the way, but Bortina was stunned by what she saw, what, what, by what she was looking at, and just stayed where she was. I tried to yell at her, but she did not move, and she was trampled by the man. The alligator in the hot dog suit stopped and did not follow after its previous mark, and instead looked down at Bortina. Then something horrible happened. The only description I can give is that it ate her soul. The alligator then jumped on the 4x4 with the dog and they drove off into a nearby forest, leaving me to cradle the now lifeless body of Bortina. Everyone in the town ignored what had just happened, so I took her body back to the motel room. <laughs> <laughs> Try to like, this is not a normal thing. After a few hours, I still had no idea what had taken place. It made no sense. I made a call to the next strangest thing that I knew. The next strangest thing that I knew, not knowing it would it would be any help. I called the rat mob. After describing what had happened, the rat man explained that it could be fixed, but I would have to make a deal with them. And after gaining my assurance that I would do whatever was necessary, they told me to wait where I was. A broken back. The next chapter. The rat man and a few rats appeared at my motel room the next morning. The rat man did not look pleased to see me, but did not say anything as he entered the room. Bortina was still on the bed. Well, let's do this. The rat man motioned to Bortina and the rats jumped up on the bed and got to work. Wait, what do I owe you for this? It started making me uneasy, but I wasn't about to back out. You and I will discuss that while my employers attend to the, my employees, my employers attend to the business at hand. Come outside with me. With that, he walked over to the door and opened it and motioned for me to go outside. Once we were outside, he closed the door. That gator stole her essence. Is essence like a soul? No, it's completely different. Stop asking questions. We can call it back, but we have to. We will incur costs in the process. You will have to make up those costs. Fortunately for you, you have something we want. Thank you. Anything, she doesn't deserve to die. Don't worry, we're already well underway. In addition, she won't remember you. This is necessary, but I don't enjoy seeing you. So we're doing this out of spite. <laughs> this isn't necessary. Oh my god, hold on. This isn't necessary, but I don't enjoy seeing you, so we're doing it out of spite. Wow, that's messed up. At, at this, the rats appeared at the window of the motel room. Looks like it's your turn. Before I could respond this, he knocked me out again. I woke up in a bed in the hotel room, and unsurprisingly, Bortino was gone. Then, the shocking thought of what they had taken from me had crossed my mind. I was not immediately sure what it was, but as soon as I tried to move, I knew. They took my spine. <laughs> In the days to come, I managed to acquire a cheap second-hand spine, though it was worn down and frequently broke. I would tape it back together when it did, and it frequently broke. I would tape it back together when it did. 
I also spent a lot of time pondering my future. Unlike the last time, the rats had not taken all my money, so I had a bit of resources to rely on. But I was not wealthy by any stretch of the imagination. Pizza executive attaché is not the most lucrative position, but it also afforded me some time to find something new. I knew I could not go back to my old job. It would keep me in too close proximity to Bortina, and while she would not remember me, I did not want to run the risk of running into her. I called Hungry and told him that I needed to try something new. He didn't see anything wrong with that and wished me luck in my endeavors. Staying in Florida seemed like an option. Maybe someday I would run into that essence stealing gator and I could enact my revenge. Helping the poor. The next chapter. <laughs> I settled in a city named Clearwater. It seemed like a nice place and not too folksy. I set out to meet some people and try to find a place to live. I noticed some people in a game store one Friday evening, so I went in. I just noticed some people in there. They were playing a card game called Magic. I had heard of the game, but never really played it. But despite my track record with real magic, this kind of seemed like it would be fun. So I sat down at a table with some nice gentlemen and they showed me how to play. What's your name? A silver-haired friendly man asked. <laughs> uh, Mike B. I'm Frank. Nice to meet you. If you don't mind me asking, do you dye your hair that color? You don't seem to be old enough to have gray hair. It was probably an imposing question, but I was genuinely curious. Haha, <laughs> no worries. I was given anesthetics during back surgery, and this was a side of... <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. I had a pretty big back surgery recently. This was somewhat of an understatement. Oh, what happened? Frank sounded genuinely concerned. A trait I react well to. Some rats took my spine. Ha ha ha, that's great. What did the rats want with your spine? Payment for my rat debt. Makes sense. At this point, we kept discussing and playing some cards. Later, they asked where I was staying and invited me to sleep on their couch for the evening. This ended up turning into weeks, and eventually I just started paying rent. I got a job at a call center, a call back earlier, from earlier in my story. It wasn't great work, but it paid, and I enjoyed spending time with my new friends. My back still hurts. Maybe someday I'll get a brand new spine. But for now, I live with what I have. From time to time, I still think about Bortina, wondering where she is and what she's doing. I took a trip once to my old town to make sure she was actually alive. I had not seen her since the accident. I found her in a coffee shop sitting with some, old, some people I assume were her friends. She looked happy, which took a huge weight off my broken spine. I've lived through a lot of strange and amazing experiences, highs and lows that are unimaginable to most people. But I find myself now in the most mundane of situations, and I cannot say that I am unhappy. Life is strange, but there is joy to be had living it. By Kerwit. That's a Mike <laughs> B. fanfic. By oh, Kerwit. Oh, that was something. That's... That was something. Man. Say, what's your name? <laughs> <laughs> oh, God, that's incredible. Oh, Destin Pro, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Whew. And on that note, we're going to play some Commander. You guys wanna you guys wanna play some commander with us? I hope you guys got some commander decks. That was incredible. We should go over the deck first. Oh, we should do that. That's a good idea. I didn't think about that. This doesn't look like a deck you can just jump right into, I'm gonna be honest. Okay, so there are twenty one lands. There are twenty three zero drop artifacts, not including these X spells. Twenty eight one mana artif one mana cards, six two mana cards, eight three mana cards, and six four mana cards. Nothing in the deck. Costs more than four mana. Kerwit, you are a uh, you are an amazing gentleman, my friend, and uh, just amazing, just incredible. What's um? So what? Can you um? Can you let me know what the what the gist of this? I don't actually know what a lot of these cards do. I'm be honest with you, because these are all like the these are just the crummy artifacts that are those in, just like, draw sets. you cards that's the only point of those right so these are all just card drawing you just play joy red and then you play a bunch of these idiots yeah oh and then you go off with like either flux reservoir i'd imagine that's probably the main way to win i'd imagine okay yeah. so we got either flux reservoir where invention can get either flux reservoir bribers purse this is just a way to tap a creature right they can't attack or block sure i doubt we're i doubt we're i doubt we're doing doing a lot for x here chimeric mass i bet a lot of these are just for zero you just want these coming down. Croc Clan Ironworks, obviously you're making a bunch of mana. Whenever one or more creatures you control does come out to a player or create a treasure, if you control five or more artifacts, transform this. Uh, and then it basically becomes Talarian Academy. 
you can tap it to add a blue for each artifact you control. That's pretty good. Experimental Frenzy, also pretty sweet here because you can just play all the zeros for free. Paradoxical Outcome, also pretty nuts. You just bounce all these. Metamorph can be pretty much anything you want. It can be whatever you want. Obviously, Metal Worker is good. You may cast Artifacts as a Delayed Flash. Obviously, just great. Artifacts cost one less, so all your zero mana artifacts net you one mana. Not kid just kidding. That's how, not how that works. Um, spells you cast cost one less, so again, you're netting a mana. So if you have both of these out, they, these give you two mana each. Nope. Okay. Well, nope. I tried. Spells cost one less again. All right, so we have three, um, like, what's the, what's the, what are the... Reductions. Saf what, the, what, are the, what are the ones that are like... The sapphires? The colored ones. Yeah, they're sapphires, I think. Well, that's just the blue one, right? Maybe. Because there's one of each color, right? What are those? What are the? What are the? What's the cycle? Uh, what's the cycle called? There's a red one. There's a blue one. They make red medallions. There we go. Yeah, these are all like we have three medallion effects. Perfect. Thank you guys. Rebuild. Return all artifacts to your hand. Then you just replay them with Joyra. Uh, for each creature, its controller sacrifices a permanent unless they pay one. Fabricate. You search for the uh, either flux or reservoir. I'll put that over there again. Wheel of Fortune, obviously great. Oh, you can storm out too. That's good. Copy artifact. That's another either flux reservoir, just in case. Hercules recall, obviously. Uh, boomerang. Transmute artifact. Sacrifice an artifact. If you do search your library for an artifact, if the cost is less, uh, you put it on the battlefield. If it's greater, you just pay the difference. So basically, you're paying for the artifact that you get, and you're just subtracting X. So if you want to get a four drop and you sacrifice a two drop, you're just gonna have to pay the, the two two mana difference, basically. Copy artifact is a medallion effect. He's right. That's true. Look at this little cutie. Whenever you cast a source spell scry one, good work, bird. Mystical tutor, obviously great. Reconstruction return an artifact from your graveyard to your hand, obviously great. Retract, return all artifacts to their owner's hands. We have like three of these effects, three of the uh the retract effect. We have rebuild, retract, Hercules recall. Retract, rebuild, recall. That's the, that's my campaign statement. Slogan. Unsummon. Barbed sextant. And I think a lot of these are going to be pretty irrelevant. I think these are all pretty familiar to people. The deck list will be in the description. In case you guys are curious. And you want to try this bad boy out. I think we're good, right? I think I've seen... Yeah, I don't think any of those zeros actually matter. I think some of them might be relevant in really specific situations, but... I think at this point it's just like, well, I think they're mostly just for drawing the cards. So I'm going to create three to four players. Only buddies can join. Allow watchers is fine. Commander open play, right? This is good. Create it. All right, we did it. Create it and debate it. I always debate it. So if you guys are in the chat, uh, you guys can feel free to join this match whenever you like. You can join whenever you like. You know, like you do. Hello. Is that Milos? My name is Milos. <laughs> Christopher, what's going on? Guys, it's commander time. Don't do me like that. Let's go to... Let's go to General. I'd be like, hey guys, come play Commander with us. Oh, also if you guys aren't... Um, this is buddies only, so if you guys aren't on my buddy list, you can just uh, send me a PM and I'll add you to my buddy list. And then... Uh, eating pizza? From where? Where are you eating pizza from? You better say... You better, you better say the right answer. He's like, I'm eating Papa John's. Papa John's is at the house. <laughs> Papa's at the house. My freezer? That's fine. I accept. I had freezer pizza earlier today. You can do whatever you like. Anybody? Come on. Where are all the... Where are all the, where are all the commander players? This is the worst part because I have no idea how many, how long people. I mean, we could just, should we just join a regular event? I've always done it with only, uh, only viewers and stuff, but I don't know, man. Should I just leave the event and just go? Should I make it? 
I'll make it anybody. You could. I don't know, man. I'm 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 worried. I'm worried about it. Where's Josh VS when we need him? Where's uh, where's T Jesse? Where's No Berts? Where where are these? Where are the Commander peeps? My computer is slow. I'll play it. Okay. Well, you take your time there, Spectral Links, old Jake, old Jakey boy, Jakey Bort, Michael lives in the trash can look at these sweet bar stools you get that camo bar stool. oh shit I'm looking for some sweet bar stools what's our EDH deck oh my god we already went over this Felix get it together we are playing Joyra Weatherlight Captain how long does it take to get a match how long does it take to get to get it what do you mean what are you asking here how long does it take to like start a match how long does the match take to finish? I don't know. You gotta, you gotta, you gotta be more clear. My question. Um, can I? I can't adjust my event once I to start it. I don't know. That's the question. I'm. I'm I mean, I don't know. Is your guess is as good as mine? We'll make anybody able to join. We'll see if that if that changes things. People could just pop in. <clears throat> I mean, it could take two. We could actually just start it with three people, which I actually do prefer because it's less chaotic and there's more action going on for us. And I like more action. Oh, all right. Oh, we did it. Is this a random person or, or someone viewing? I don't know. I don't know. It could be anybody. Who knows? Who's to say? Oh, they're gone. They're like, no, nah, this isn't what I want to be. I was like, okay, see you later. What a weird, what a weird thing. I feel like I'm way back in. I feel like I'm back in like the, the early 2000s playing games where people are like, like in WoW, like they'll like hop into your your thing and then they'll just be like, all right, I'm leaving. Like in chat rooms, like people will be like show up in the chat room and they're like, oh shit, there's only like two people in here. This is really awkward. And then you just leave. And people will be like, hey man, what's up? What's going on? And then you're like, you don't say anything. You just leave. You're like, eh, no, I'm good, man. I can't interact with you. Then it's, it's a whole, it's a whole to do. This is one of the rough things with Commander that if we don't coordinate it correctly and then there's like people just don't um they're not they're just not around. They're not around for the to play against so that it's hard to get a match. Whereas like you can always have a if you're playing modern or standard, you can always just find an opponent. But when you're looking for like three other people with commander decks, you're like, oh, this is a lot. So one more person and we're good. I'd say you're showing your age, but I remember that time too. Yeah, I mean like like AOL chat rooms, you know, you're like, you're like, oh, let's see what's in this one. And that's like two dudes and you're like, but then they get real excited. It's like you're going, it's like you're at a convention hall. Oh, let's start. It's like you're at a convention hall and um, you're like all the, there's a bunch of different doors with a bunch of different demos going on. Right. And you go to the one, you go in the one demo and you're like, they're like, Hey man, good to see you. What's going on? You want to check out the game? And you're like, no, I just was I I just accidentally came in here. I'm sorry. Are we gonna play first? How come there's no Mox Ruby and Mox Sapphire in the deck? I think this is a keep. Yeah, I think so too. I was trying to add it up to make sure we had the three, but unfortunately, we have to play all our artifacts in order to get Metalworker. But Frenzy's pretty good, so you can do whatever you like. Where's the... Uh, there we go. So we got... Arix Mythies. The Slumbering Isle. You know this guy? Mm hmm Oh, we got two... We got two... Two, uh... We got two, uh... Two Simic decks here. Holds zero drops when you have Joyra, but we have to get our Moxopal online, right? Yeah, we kind of need mana. M -m -m mana. I mean, I think we might just play Welding Jar, but is someone going to counter our Codex Shredder? They're like, Codex Shredder and Commander, huh? It's a bold strategy. Well, you know what they say. Oh, well, right. I mean, after the, yeah, of course, I'm not just going to be, I'm not just going to be playing artifacts all willy-nilly. What am I, a maniac? Do you think I'm a maniac? Yeah. It's fair. 
Mama maniac. What's the matter with you? Uh, Felipe, uh, Felipe went to the Weird Al Yankovic concert tonight. Oh, yeah. He just, like, he, uh, he netted some sweet tickets for that. I'm gonna mill, I'm gonna mill Ofinity. Pow! What do we hit? Dismiss into dream. That's probably helpful. He doesn't want to draw that seven match. Got him. We did get him. Mike, how was the family visit? It's all right. Mike said he was so offended that he just left. He was like, I just didn't want to be there anymore. I was so mad. What happened? That didn't happen. He's just embarrassed about it. It's fine. Don't worry about it. We don't have to talk about it. Is it our turn again? Oh, cool. That was quick. If this isn't a land, though, I feel real bad. Hmm. I guess we can play this and crack it, right? That's pretty much all we can do here, right? Because we got three drop, four drop, three drop, zero drop. Let's add a blue. A blue ski. Oh, that ain't going to do it. All right. Do we need yeah, this is my problem with 21 lands. It's rough. You got to hit multiple of them. Mike is in denial. It's pretty painful. It's just he he just pretends all the traumatic moments of his life don't happen, like like his dad getting cigarettes, his back pain, his rat debt, Bortina. He just pretends that they were just fake. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. Did you um do you ever talk to Howie anymore? To Hungry? To Mr. Howie? This is also It's called a fan fiction, Frank, okay? Look, man, I, I don't know your life. I'm just going to mill this person. Wow, I'm just hitting all the expensive shit. All right, well, we're just going to pass here. His family visit was under maintenance. They tweeted about it. It'll be rescheduled at a later time. That's because your entire family is under maintenance, Michael. Oh, look at that. Do you see that morph? I've seen it. Do you see it? Yes. I really want another land, I'll be honest with you. Do you know what it's like needing land? And not having it? Do you want do you want, do you know? Yeah. He doesn't know shit. He always does this. It's unbelievable. Destroy an artifact or enchantment. Can I sacrifice to regenerate itself? I'm going to make it so you can't put that land into play, you cheater. Got him. We did get him. This has a regeneration shield on it now. Whoa, 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 whoa. You like that? No, please stop. That's how shields sound, Michael. Do you ever watch sci-fi things? Sci-fi anythings? Do you ever watch sci-fi? I love the sci-fi. If I just can get one land, I feel like we're in great... We're in a great world. We're in a great world! Do you know what it's like to be a sad man? To be the bad man. To be the Batman? Behind blue eyes. Guys, I have to deal with this every day. <laughs> it's unbelievable. But Max dreams, they are as empty. Did you draw a card? No, it's at the beginning of the next upkeep. God, you don't know anything about... That's stupid. You don't know anything about baubles, do you? Here it is, you ready? Oh, I just want to land. Ash is like, I'm going to give him the least amount of lands possible. In 21 out of 99, it's pretty low. That's one fourth. So that means out of eight cards, you should have two lands. But this is a. Uh, we've done. We've worked out, We have one land and 14 cards so far, which is pretty rough. 13 cards. That seems lower than average. If our opponents could actually stop doing things until we hit a second land, I'd appreciate it. Oh, I think if you. Had, F6 at F6 is through all the turns now. I don't know if that's a new change or not. But I hit 6 and it, I didn't have to hit it again when it got to Cornelius Magnificent's turn. Mm. 
Okay. If you could have one fictional old timey name, what would it be? I don't really have an answer for that. Well, you gotta think about it, man. Think about it. Probably man. Bob Rigmus. That's that's a real name. That's a real that's a real thing. That's a real name. That's a land. Ba 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 rigmos ba 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 rigmos. You can't play cards in your hand, right? That's interesting. Yeah, I don't, I don't think jamming that's good here. What about this guy? How does this guy not just die immediately? No, you want to wait till you can play drawer next turn. To play metalworker? Do I want to reveal a bunch of cards next turn? No, you just want to draw your and start drawing a bunch of cards. You want to go on a joy ride? Yeah, joy ride. Joy ride? Mm hmm. We could also go blue, float three, Hercules recall. Play this, play this. Hmm. Okay. I guess I'll just pass here. I think I like Metalworker, but then this doesn't get untapped, so. Yeah, what are you going to do with a bunch of colorless mana? Play Metalworker, Michael. Mm -hmm. I'll make a big Chimeric Mass, okay? Cool. How come we don't have... We should have Lightning Greaves in this deck, right? Gives Metalworker haste, protects Joyra. Triggers Joyra. Probably should be in the deck, yeah. Oh, a little toothy. Oh, a little toothy. Just burp. Maybe. You're disgusting. I like that they went two here and then they went two here, I think. Alright, so this is Anders Battlefield with five counters on it, so it's basically just Merit Lage. Uh, when you cast a spell, you remove a counter. So if they cast five spells, it becomes a 12 12. Mm hmm. It's pretty good. It's pretty good. Well, this looks like one spell, not five. Oh, boy. That's a big boy. That's a fat daddy. Oh. Is it even worth me milling here? I'm just kind of doing it for funsies. Yeah, I don't know why you're doing it. Because it's just there. So I don't want to lose to them having one card in their library because that would be terrible. So. Pay one. Pay four for mana bolts ability. No. No. I kind of want to land here. What if we hit a big-ass land pocket? Land pockets! Oh, yes. Excellent. Blue. This. Joyra. Cast Joyra. I'll use two of the three colorless mana. You ready for this? Kapow. Bazinga. Hey, land. Hey, listen. Oh, land. Jesus, man. Come on. Go that way. <laughs> These are all terrible, dude. Good lord. This is what you get. This is what father likes. What are we? Yeah. What do I get? What? That's what I get for what though. Oh, do we just play this? Get like a volcanic island and then uh, Hercules recall. Seems okay. Um. So we have one floating. We add a blue. Like we can't play mass for zero, so it just dies, right? You still get the draw card. Is that better than just... There's only one other zero drop. This is the only one left. So I'll just play it for zero, I guess. Just to draw the card. Oh, does it say it? Oh, it doesn't die. It's because it's not a creature unless you activate it. Oh, that's so good. Man, what a time to be alive. Oh, boy, this is nice. This is what father likes. Oh, Everflowing Chalice, too? C -c -c claws of Jix. Is it Gix or Jix? Answer me, Michael. Answer, Father. He's not saying anything. What's going on? Is he dead? Can you guys let me... Can you guys in the chat let me know if Michael died? Me did. Me did. Just cast it for zero, bro. Oh. Oh. Daddy's doing it. What's our storm count right now? 700? Okay, so we have one... Alright, we easily, easily play this. 
city. This is too many lands. Now this is too many lands. Wait. Oh, that's going to cost too much. Because we have one, two, three, four, five mana. Is there any trick that we can use? I think you just search it out, right? Either what? Either Flux Reservoir? Mm -hmm. But then we can't play it. We can play it next turn. But then we all all our artifacts are going to play. We got uh, Boomerang. <laughs> so you're saying just bounce one artifact? <gasps> See, it all worked out. Now, uh, now we go to Oh goosh! <laughs> oh goosh! You heard me. I'll add a zero too, just to, just to be on the safe side. Three and one. Do we have anything else for zero in our hand? It doesn't look like it. Why don't you go get the reservoir, bro? Because we're casting rebuild. And then we float one, and then we have Mox Level Mana Vault, Mana, Comp, Mana Crypt again. If we get the reservoir, we can't do anything. I'm just going to cast this now, and we're going to try to go off, right? And everyone's going to be like, this is miserable. I'm sorry I joined this. And I'm going to be like, I am also sorry that you joined this. Do you want to play this deck yet? Because I feel like this is right up your alley, man. Oh, man. I, I mean, it's too focused. Like... Are we dead? I just want to make sure we have enough cards in our deck. We need seven mana, right? Or we can just... Oh, that's good. That's the end. That's got to be the end, right? You still need a way to win, man. We have Fabricate. Do we have enough mana to do all that? Are you serious? We we have Crack Clan Ironworks. Crack <laughs> Do we replay the... Oh, no! Oh, I just found it. How's that sound? Well, that makes it easier. Uh, one, two, play... This guy with one of it. No, wait, we want to do that one you first, play, right? Yeah, yeah. We'll do that first. This is, this is hard. Oh, Ornithopter? Fantastic. This deck. Every every one mana spell is two mana now. So, sack this. Sack this. Play this. Oh, God. This guy's like, I'm out. <laughs> and, alright, so we're going to always yield to these how much life did we just gain like 40 cast this we're at 63 let's see what happens when this is it it's pay 50 life deal 90. 50 damage right yes <laughs> this is insane oh lordy oh lordy uh, I actually just want to sack an artifact here Wow, every art Okay, so we went from 90. So we should go up to like 117 here or something ridiculous. How much damage does this deal? 50? <laughs> oh, God. This deck wasn't fun at all for anybody. Yeah, as soon as I saw you load up this deck, I'm like, this is not a friendly deck. <laughs> See, because you're used to Commander, so, like, I look at this deck, and I'm just like, I don't, it doesn't look like it does anything. I have no idea. This is where Affinity is, like, counter, uh, for Spike. Uh, Days. Days is the word I'm looking for. Crackland Ironworks are $9? My god, I have a gold mine in my, in my collection. Like, my collection is just full of shit that, like, I didn't know was commander expensive. Oh, I have to put these on the stack. Oh my god, I'm such an I'm such an ass. I don't actually have to do anything right now. I could just do this, right? <laughs> okay. Oh god. Well, we had a good run. Oh, it's got to be much faster because like you don't have to keep track of all the things. 
So I in think real life, this deck would be a lot faster too. I mean, less fast, right? No, you would just be like, play this, play this, play this, play this, play this. Well, he said my friend said my my friend said it was faster online, and I guess it really is. I I feel like it'd be faster online because. You don't have to do all the math. You don't have to count the like the mana. You don't have to count the the reservoir stuff. Because like, despite it being faster, but that's just about being proficient with playing the deck, though. Right, but you you have three other people who also want to know exactly what's going on too, right? I don't know. It seems like it'd be faster online because just because of the details, like return all the things to my hand, floating mana, trying to figure things out. You think lightning greaves? You like lightning greaves? I do. I do. It might not be necessary though. I like protecting Joyra. We had a good run. What? What? I mean, like, is there anything in the deck that doesn't even like maybe Shimmer Mirror? Because I just didn't see a situation where like I want to cast things at instant speed. Yeah, Shimmer is meh. You could cut that. My problem is the deck is so focused that it's like not really fun. It just does the same thing every game. It's just like play. Dora, right. There's no like. Vomit out your hand. Kill the table. Like that's all you do. Every yeah. Game. There's no. There's no room for like. You can't really, uh, you can't, there's no nuance. Like, I like, I don't mind combos and decks, but, like, this is so focused that it's just, like, it's one-dimensional. Like, you're basically just playing vintage Blue-Red Storm. I don't think Unwinding Clock actually does much, because it untaps you all artifacts, but, like, you're, a lot of your artifacts don't do anything. Yeah, you probably don't need it. Thran Dino is probably too expensive. Shimless, you not deck yourself by responding to Drawer's Trigger. How? Did I miss something about Shimmer Mirror? You can cast artifact spells as though they had flash. Oh, because if you have infinite cards in your deck, you can, like, instead of drawing the card with Joyra, you get to play another zero artifact on top of it. And then the trigger goes on the stack, and then you play another one on top of it. And so you can just keep, you can just keep stacking Joyra triggers. Oh, so and then you kill the table. Yeah. Oh, sure, sure. That seems... Jesus, that seems so nuanced. I guess we put it back in. I mean, I guess it's a thing. What is copy artifact? What is, I mean, like, what are we copying with it? Yeah, I'm sure you can copy any any rock. It's pretty good. It's funny to look at, like, the one and two cost pile, because I'm like, well, none of these are really, like... I can't really be like, is this doing anything good? Is this doing anything? Because they're not meant to, you know what I mean? They just draw you a card. Right. Yeah. Oh, we're just copying, like, Helm of Awakening or... Uh, yeah. Foundry Inspector, what have you. Let's sort by, not color, because that's not going to do it. Search by meta cost. Um, Jesus. Like, if I were to make this deck, I'd make it way less focused and more blue-red fun stuff, but... That's funny to hear you say that, because you're like... Well, because, like... You're pretty cutthroat, man. Do we, what's Fade Away? Why do we care about Fade Away? What does it do? For each creature, its controller sacrifices a permanent unless they pay one. Is it just, like, kind of like a... Like a, like a breath effect? Probably like a getcha. Getcha. Is it for each creature? Or is each, yeah. So, we, like, because you have no creatures in the deck. Like, I like to I like to win in Commander, but I don't like it to be so easy. That's what your mom said to me. She was like, I like to win in Commander, but I don't like it to be so easy. And I was like, all right, that's weird, but... You know. What about that... Enchantment. Is that ever going to flip? This? At the beginning of your end step, if you control five or more artifacts? I mean, probably every time. Oh, okay. I My my bigger concern is just casting it because it's four, but... I mean, like, it's... What about really, Experimental Frenzy? I was wondering that, too, because, like, most of the time you want to be playing from your hand. Either Flux Reservoir seems kind of meh. Yeah, well, you could probably cut the Reservoir. Then your deck I could actually cutting nothing. experimental frenzy like yeah I would cut that I didn't want four play mana it. do nothing it's it four mana like. and like if you're no paradox engine I don't even know what that is you don't need it is it like the big one that untaps yeah because it doesn't matter it doesn't matter you're not trying to untap anything all your stuff is free you could probably put it in but I don't think you need it oh no what 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 just happened I don't know God I really hope I didn't oh I think I got I think I'm out right. Okay, good lord. I almost joined, I just, I, that was like, I just literally went into the chat room and I was like. You playing another one? Yeah, what, what do you mean? You want to play one, what, we're going to play one game? That was quick, that was super quick. We spent more time reading. We're not going to get any more opponents, man, I don't know. 
People are not going to want to play you. Frenzy lets you play from the top. That's literally what it does. That's correct. I like that you're like, let me, I'm going to read you. I'm going to read you what Experimental Frenzy does. Yeah, but the problem is that like, it locks you out of your hand too. And with Joyra, you're drawing so many cards. Like you're going to be drawing a card for every card you play. So it's almost impossible to empty your hand in any kind of efficient manner. So you're like, all right, I'll play this. I'll play this. I'll play this. Oh no, I have three more cards in my hand. So like, I think a lot of times like just playing from your hand. Oh, Josh is, VS is firing up. Let's let's get it going. There was a big update today, so. Though I have no idea why I would want to do this to myself. <laughs> uh. you usually fill your hand then kill the frenzy. Oh, sure, I guess. I am super not into this. Sorry, that's totally fine. Sarah's like, if I was playing this 1v1 in modern against people, I'd be fine with it. But because it's commander. This is just a very cutthroat deck. It's a, like, I could, yeah, I don't, like, yeah, that first match was like, all right, I guess you're both dead. I missed my land drop for six turns, but I guess once I hit it, you're dead. <laughs> we literally cast Joyra, and then we won the game the turn after. Did I miss the last chapter of the Mike fan fiction? You did, but I'll be posting them all as their, their own independent video on YouTube so be sure to go to youtube.com this is a really easy storm deck There's, it's like very hard not to are you going to wait for Josh VS uh, I think we could do oh well now we don't have a, now we don't have a choice three people what about three people are the we only still... weakness this deck really has is like if you don't have Joron play you're not doing anything correct but that so seems like a pretty big weakness right oh it, it's huge yeah Hugh, it's gonna be huge who is this Ravos Chicken Tender? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's Ravos Chicken Tender, you know. Other creatures get plus one, plus one. At the beginning of your upkeep, you may return a creature card from your graveyard to your hand. Oh, wow, that's gas. And we have Thrasios Triton Hero. Two mana for one, three. Four mana to scry. Real top card to the to land, put on the battlefield tapped. Otherwise, draw a card. That's that guy's tier one, by the way. This? Yep. By himself? Yep. I mean, it's a one, three for two. Like, that's pretty good. Uh, no, we'll keep this hand. Two lands, please. Yeah, there's a bunch of ways to use Thrasos. 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 What about Ravos Chicken Tender? He probably just plays them for the other colors. He's like, I just wanted white black. I'll never cast this five mana two two. Wait, if the one three for two is totally relevant, you tell me the four mana scry one is is the that's the good part of the deck? Yeah. Also, he's blue-green, so you get access to two of the best colors. Four mana? To scry one and then just put a land and draw a card? You mentioned WoW earlier. When are you going to join me in WoW Classic? Uh, after this. He's a good infinite mana after sink. After stream. Got him. If you have infinite mana, you can just, like, scry your whole deck. There's so many players that it's hard to keep track of whose turn it is. You got Mirror Pool over here. You got Smoldering Crater over here. What is this hand recap, by the way? Mox Ope. What do you mean? What is it? I was just looking at your hand. I didn't actually... Just look at it. Well, you don't have to ask me. You can just look, man. Ditlo, thank you so much for the for saying so, man. I really appreciate it, buddy. Dazden Pro, I didn't even see the sub. Thank you so much, man. Well, yes, I did. Yes, I did. That was a while ago. I lied. I already said thank you for that. If you don't stop, you. If you don't stop burping in my goddamn face, Michael. This is a revenge for all the... You know what. I don't. For all your farts. <laughs> wow. Wow. Um, Thrasios is broken and should be banned? Do you, do you think so? Yeah. He's an infinite mana sink. There's plenty of those. He's two mana, though, which is kind of... Being a two mana infinite mana sink is kind of... Hmm. Two mana infinite mana sink. <laughs> I kind of just want to play this, but I... I, I Don't. I, I can't. I want to play Amulet, right? You don't play this for one? I wouldn't have played anything. I just would have played Island Pass. Really? Yeah, I would have saved the mocks if you can. Because you have four ma you have four lands. Yeah, I guess you're right. So there's no reason to really play it. Well, I want to play Jorgon 3, not on 4, man. Come on. What are you, little baby? You can wait to play around 4. What? Yeah, the, the partner ability is super relevant on Thrasos. 
Yeah, the partner ability is super relevant on Thrasios. <laughs> Give me some chicken nuggets! <gasps> Why am I all... I don't know, that's, that's weird. weird. I've never seen that before. Whoa. Oh my god. What's going on? Is that my elbow? That is my elbow, okay. What, what part of my body is that? What is this, a plague mirror? Oh, you about to get infected, boy. Who played that? Uh, Chris a and red player. Maybe not. It could just be a mono red thing. Ain't nothing but a mono red thing, baby. I think if I had unlimited money for magic, I would have three decks. Did you see this improvement to upcoming card stock notification? No. Announcement? What is it? As of as early as a June... That's fine. As early as June 7th, you may start noticing some slight variances to War of the Spark card stock as we continue to look for ways to make your playing and collecting experiences the best it can be. We are introducing a new playing card paper for Magic the Gathering. Ooh, that's exciting. That's exciting. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Oh, belly. <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, so what we can do is go... Just pass. We can play Joy right here, though. Can we not? How? Zero artifact. Mm -hmm. Play the mana vault. Three, that's three artifacts. Three, four, five. Play this for one, draw a card. It's not worth it. Just wait. Oh my god. I don't want to die before we You're kill not, them. How are you going to die? I don't know, Commander, man. Who's I just don't want to die. Look at your opponent. I don't want to die. Yeah, but like, I okay, so my frame of reference is the broken shit that we just did on turn four. Oh, what up, Team J, bro? It's your boy. We're playing some commander right now. We will be playing. Uh, we will be playing some. Uh, what's that? What's that format called? Vintage Cube. After so. Anyway, what's the stock stuff? Okay, some of you might be aware that we began introducing different playing cardboard in the Japanese market several years ago, and in 2018 we expanded distribution of that stock to other markets with both Battle Bond and Ultimate Masters. The Battle Bond cards did feel way different. They felt a lot like a lot more slippery, but not like in a bad way. And Ultimate Masters, same thing with Ultimate Masters. Ultimate Masters has a very different feel to it. So let's this. So let's get a regular card. Yeah, I'm trying to find like a normal one. That's not a. I think these are different. I think so. Oh yeah, yeah. Wow. There's yeah. A big, yeah. This one is much. The Ultimate sturdier. Masters is yeah. It's like it's like it's gets because I got shine. Oh, Mulder. Yeah, it's nicer actually. So that's a good thing. Oh, yeah, this is, like, dry, but this is, like, slick. Yeah, and also it oh, yeah, feels are, thicker, too. If you guys had an Ultimate Masters card and a War of the Spark card, they seem totally different. Uh, this year, in our continued commitment to developing new and improved processes and materials, we're introducing another card stock into our, into, our, into our portfolio. While there are a multitude of reasons we're pleased with this new paper, in particular, we are happy with improvements in areas of our development focus. Surface consistency for printing, improved card cutting, as well as rigidity and snap. I like that they appreciate those things. I like a good snap. I do like a good snap. What favors do I have to do for those full arts? <laughs> so before we got into this card stock, if I had limited, unlimited magic money, I would build three commander decks. Yeah, he was going to say this, and I was like, card stock, Michael. One would be super ultra competitive like this. One mid tier and then one low tier, so you got all types, you know. Yeah, and then you can you sit down against cutthroats. You're like, all right, I got. I'll be cutthroat too. You sit down against a, a normal. You play the middle one and then the last one. A normal. If you sit down against a normal. <laughs> and as always, we are committed to creating and shipping the best product possible, and we'll continue to explore ways to improve upon our best products and practices. We look forward to players and fans getting their hands on the new paper and letting us know what they think. Okay. Okay, man. We have to go off this turn. I'm sorry. We just have to win, Michael. Do you understand, Michael? Do you understand how to win? Michael? Can you, Michael, can you understand? Okay. Do you not think so? Can we, do we have another turn? He perforosed. Are we dead? I don't want to Perforos die. is actually pretty dangerous. Perforos can lead to some really, really nuts things. I'm so excited for the first sliver. I just can't wait. I think that that's going to make some sweet decks. Is that the... That's the five-color sliver boy? Yeah, the cascade that lets your other slivers cascade. Okay, so we play Mana Vault, right? Off of red. No. Why wouldn't you play the... 
No. Why didn't play what? I would have just paid it off the colorless land, right? I was thinking that too. But I wasn't sure. I was like, maybe I want to save this for something, something better. I give good place. I don't know what that means, man. I'm cheap. I don't know what that. I don't know what's going on here. Is this getting? Is this getting? Is this getting inappropriate? <laughs> I give good price. I can't. I don't think you could say I'm cheap and I give good price in back-to-back -back sentences, right? If you're trying to buy something from someone, you can't say I'm cheap and I give you a good price because you're. Yeah, it doesn't make sense. That's two different things, man. All right, so let me just play this for zero, right? Wait, why? Because we need three artifacts to activate this. Oh, okay. I guess, no, we could do it. We could do that last, right? Yeah, you're right. I'm so, I'm so dumb. God, you're so much smarter than me, Michael. I know. Zero. No, cancel. Just play it for zero. Done. Look at me. Do any of these do anything? Not really. Oh, we can brain freeze someone right now, dude. I don't think I it's think, gonna be effort enough. I think we're out. We got one, two, three, four, five. We don't have enough. We're doing it. The dream is so alive right now. I think the dream just died. The dream is dead. Okay, we're gonna pass here. That was a good turn. I have a standard 5K in weeks. What should I take? Ah, that's a good question. I think you were, were you talking about this? Weren't you talking about this in Discord? My problem is with Vintage Cube for the past week and a half, I haven't watched any sort of standard. When is um when is Modern 2020 come out? No. Magic 2020. Magic 20? What the hell's the name of that set, man? Please play? What's going on over here? Is this is this what happens when you play against randoms on on Magic Online? They just act super weird. I don't know. I don't play Magic Online very often. I know, apparently, but I'm trying to Core Set 2020, Core 2020, Modern Horizons. Modern 2020? I don't know what's going on anymore. I'm clearly drunk. You might all be dead. We might be dead from who? Who's killing well, us? Well, he's got a the that thing, and he's got a perforo, so that, that could be a lot of damage if he can like string a bunch of stupid creatures together. I think mana's their bottleneck here, though, right? Yeah, probably. Please play? What's going on, man? I don't know what that means. July 5th? Oh my god, less than a month? So, wait. This weekend is the Mo Modern Horizons pre-release and then, like, in three weeks after that is the... Yeah, that's fine. Oh, you're... Yeah, you're good. Ain't nothing happening. Is the Magic 2020 pre-release? That's pretty ridiculous. Of course the 2020 doesn't have a card named Hindsight. I'm gonna be sad. Oh my god. That would be great. Like, it's so on the nose, but it's still very good and, like, you don't get a chance to do oh, it. Oh, because 2020. It's, yeah. That's Hindsight. Mm-hmm. I feel like if you untap, we're just going to win the game. We got three draws here, at least. Whenever you a creature controls damage, we draw a card, sure. Well, they, they tapped out. And I doubt they're attacking us. They're probably attacking old... old. And even if they do, so what? I'm cheap. I give good place. Please play. I don't think English is their first I don't language. think anything in this chat is... Uh, is is yep going both after Warzer, Wozer, Wozer, Wozer hasn't even done anything. Sorry, it definitely does feel like War of the Spark just came out. I agree with you. Can't keep up with all these sets, man. It's like set fatigue, man. Like, it definitely is. It's a real thing where you're like, I can't, I can't keep up with this. Should I build a Nico Bolas deck with all Nico Boluses in it? Yes. 1,000% yes. <laughs> he gives good place. I wasn't sure if place meant price or if it was some sort of uh, euphemism. 
Hey, bro, you want to talk about my place? I really don't. No, thank you. Oh, dang it. Because I have that. Are we going to die here? Michael, are we going to die on the battlefield? What does this do? Regenerate creature. I'm not sure if any of these are relevant. They're not. I'm going to say nay. Let's play this and crack it for a good old-fashioned... Uh, Volcanic island? Yes. We minimize our, our chances to, to draw Landos. Oh, that's good. That's pretty nice. We make sure one mana thing, zero mana. Wait, didn't I have one floating? Did I not? No. Whatever, man. I don't need your sass. You're going to have it anyway. That's good. Lotus Petal is actually a pretty good draw. This is this is we're dead. Done. Oh god, it's happening. It's all happening. Oh god, it's all happening. Brain freeze could probably kill all these people, right? Like we're getting to a point where I we're mean just... not yet, but how about now? <laughs> I would definitely do that. Oh yeah, we're doing that for sure. One, two, three. <laughs> this deck is so good. <laughs> oh god, I'm so sorry, everyone in the in the game that we're playing right now. Oh Jesus, this is where they leave. They're like, "No, you're not my friend," so I'm not gonna put up with this bullshit. Mox Opal. I was gonna play Helm. Sure. Ash is like, tap rocks first. I'm like, buddy, listen, I top eight a pro tour. You ever hear about that? Just kidding. I didn't do that. I wish there was a way that I didn't have to respond to all my things, but whatever. Can a dude just get a thing? Can I just get an Aetherflux Reservoir so I can literally nug my opponent for seven billion? This is casual. Is it? Oh, look, now they're getting mad. Oh, man. Here we are. This is what I was afraid of. Oh, I'm getting hated. I'm sorry, guys. It's not my deck. Jesus. I feel so terrible. The, 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 the badness that I feel right now is palpable, man. But they're still here. Why are they still here? Oh, crying out loud, dude. I wouldn't even do that yet. How many cards do we have left? 18 cards? No, that's our hand. Jesus, just give me the goddamn thing so I can kill them. Well, I guess we can win the game now because... What is this? Scrying? Bottom. I'm sorry, guys. Really, I am. Is this Fabricate? No, it's just a stupid copy artifact. You should play the uh, the XX thing. Just for zero? Yeah. No. Zero. Oh, God. Don't do that. Done. Just play it. Oh my god, I really just want to draw the stupid... Uh... Please give me another Flux Reservoir. I really don't want to... I, I, I really just... Oh god. I think it'd be awesome if you fizzle. <laughs> <laughs> like, it's virtually impossible, right? Because we can just bounce everything. Do we have blue mana? Yeah, we have Mox. Oh, we have... Yeah, we also yeah. have Lotus Petal. We have tons of... Yeah, we have tons of things. It's never just going to... It's never going to happen. This is brutal. I'm trying, I swear. <sighs> so we can just play this and... Was that it? These guys are weird. This feels like my first experience on the internet where everyone's weird and I'm like, 
What are you why are you, what are you saying right now? I don't think I don't think it's in here anymore. I think the card is gone. Can we just bounce everything? This is so boring for everybody. I'm so, I feel so Do we have enough What's our storm count? I wish I knew. Just do it, man. <laughs> no, bounce everything first. Oh god, why? Blue. Oh, crying out. And then play the What are we playing? The, the unsummon thing that returns all your artifacts. Uh, play solitaire one more than that. Uh, come on, dude, just chill out. That thing. Yeah, no, I know. I just, I'm really like reluctant. I'm like, I'm having serious anxiety about doing it right and now. And concede. <laughs> oh my god! Don't waste people's time. Playing the right room? Is there a different room? It's just, what, is there a right, is there a... There's probably a competitive room, I imagine. There's a competitive commander room? I wouldn't doubt it. Really? Oh god, this is... No, we didn't do friends only for this specific one, just because I was like, let's see if we can... <laughs> yes oh god there is this just says free for all right like what is free for all it's like it's called 1v1 oh I see well this is pretty much a 1v1 deck I see well you just need a, a proper pod of competitive deck a proper pod Also, in a proper competitive pod, you can be way dead before Jorah is played. I'm cringing, I'm cringing so hard. You can just concede. Thank you. Fuck that. I'm not conceding. I'm going to either flex these bitches out, man. Oh, this dude's gone. That's a win. Two left. Just play through the pain. Like, this is so... This is so... This is making me so... Hey, you, know who, you know who you are right now? Who? You're Nate. Nate <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were going to say that as soon as like, oh, God. No offense if you're watching, but you play super competitively. Who gets this salty, though? This is unreal, man. This is crazy. Like, I'm interacting with you. I'm just concede. Like, if you're that mad, just concede. Mm. Yeah, but now it's principal. Now I'm like, you leave. No, not you. I mean, oh, the other yeah, person. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, just concede. Look, man. Okay, th this is, this is going to sound really mean. But you should be able to kill a 3-3. Three, three. That's all I'm saying. This is a 3-3, three, three, right. You exactly. kill that 3-3? Three, three, there's no game. I have no game. Especially mid-combo, mid you're just like, uh, I guess I have to discard 20 cards and, uh, uh, oh no. The faster, you, the faster you kill this, or the faster you hit okay, the faster I can kill you with Aetherflux Reservoir. I love that calling this a net deck when I thought of this from nothing. Wow. They probably... They... I mean, this deck is pretty easy to come up with nothing personal but like everyone figured this deck out as soon as she was printed this guy just shook his head so hard it required caps <laughs> i'm shaking my head in caps lock what is going on i don't just hit okay it's not me right it's waiting now he's on. being salty he's gonna make you he's gonna run down your clock but it's not it's not on me it's on them though like his clock is literally running down no that's the that's your punishment you have to i guess that seems weird. Is this it? Like, this is weird. What a weird way to behave towards other human beings. I don't understand what's going on. What a narcissistic, self-serving... Oh. What are you saying? I'm like, this is a weird way to behave, gotta be honest, man.
this like makes me not want to like this this is amazing because it makes someone not want to play the format i'm just like i don't even want to play with commander players now because this is ridiculous that this is how you act <laughs> can i get that good place still okay i guess i guess we won the game i'm gonna minimize it so that we can does anybody else want to play against this deck uh, guys Okay, we're doing buddies only this time. Josh, feel free to bring your most broken shit. Yeah, bring it up. Bring your broken stuff, guys. To be fair, Drover's not even tier one. You're not even tier one. Wow. Because you can storm way faster without the commander. You can storm Shut up and take my money. way faster. Play this song and replace Peter with Frank and music with Deg. Oh god, this is going to go demonetized, isn't it? <laughs> but like the most competitive commander decks are just storm decks, right? <clears throat> and a real competitive um storm deck for commander, you don't play your general. Like it doesn't even your general doesn't matter. You just play generals for it's, colors. It cracks me up that you call it commander. You're like in a serious game of commander. You don't play your general. You literally change the word that you just said, which is referencing the card. To Didn't general. I say commander? No, well, you said in a game of commander. In a, in a game of commander, oh. you, you, you don't play your general. That's just it's, ingrained. It's so funny because you switched it. Like you said the right one when you named the format, which is named after the next card, which you changed the name of. Yeah, you know? you're, it's just funny. Yeah, Chris is like, can we talk about the silent top left opponent, the real MVP? Yeah, way to go, uh. Wait, yeah, way to go, Wozier. What a narcissistic, self-serving dick. That's insane. That's crazy, dude. He is a member of the heebie-jeebies. So. He gives me the heebie-jeebies. Yeah, he's... MTGO is updating. Yeah, MTGO had a pretty big update today, so get your updates ready, boys. Whatever the hell that means. I have no idea. I, I, I have no idea. I'm stealing some raisins from you. I'll steal. Okay. I feel like these raisins are going to attack me. I feel that way every time. I'm like, you guys are coming out slowly now. Good news is when you start your turn four, I can just go play. I can go play Total War until I'm dead. <laughs> I've been considering playing uh, through Skyrim, through The Witcher Three, or just keep playing Fallout. I'm not sure which I should do though. Ash, I think the deck itself is unfun for everyone else, but I think the experience that we've had. Has been pretty fun so far. I'm pretty okay with it. Have you never played through Skyrim? What'd you say to me? Have you never played through Skyrim? Not all the way. Mm. It's pretty fun. It's pretty long though, right? Uh, the main campaign's a decent chunk. The main campaign's a decent... You're a decent chunk. Wow. Got him. Holy shit, I just wrecked that dude. What a decent little chunk. And uh, if you guys haven't done so, definitely check out CoolStuffInc.com. You can use promo code FRANK5 to get 5% off. And definitely check out the article on Cube I did today because uh, it has my my thoughts on Modern Horizons in the Cube. And uh, do me a favor, leave a comment in the article. Let me know what you think. And uh, help me out. It looks good. As long as it's been good to me. Yeah, I've been entertained so far. I've, I've had a good time. Didn't Sarah start by like saying, no, I'm sorry, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> this is not like fun and now she's like yeah i'll play i like that they they uh they gray out the start button for a few minutes so like if you jump in you can jump out real quick how much is a commander commission i have been doing an ideal sex fork deck i've been thinking about for ages tinkering with but close yeah um i've been like for normal deck critiques i i my default is 50 but if that's too much for someone we can definitely talk about it it's not it's not like set in stone 
that just covers the time, me getting the cards, the entry fees, stuff like that. So, well, I can't sleep, so here we are. I like I like Paradise Mantle. Equipped creature has uh, what's what's it? Who's it's? And then you go to your collection, and you're like creatures. Oh, there is creatures in this deck. Oh, but like, they're not good creatures, right? You're never gonna equip that to anything. You put on your drawer. This is so weird that they're just like, yeah, I'll just stay in here forever. And this guy's still here too? That's so weird, man. We keeping this? You think keep this? It only needs like one land. Josh will just kill us before. Oh, so you've gotten really lucky with these mox opals, man. A three for three, man. Gonna minimize you but leave audio on. Pretty sure it doesn't matter if I can see your hand, but whatever. Yeah, it's well. Oh, we got Yis on the Wanderer Bard. How do you feel about that guy? That's a competitive dude. Is he really mono green? Yeah. Ultra fast mono green. It's our turn. Do you want to? <laughs> Oh, I actually laughed at that. That was pretty funny. Do you want to... You want you to hold this? You said hold this? Take my money. I would for now, yeah. A dollar for each player who had fun in the last game. <laughs> Buck wild. Appreciate it. Technically, we're still winning, so that's cool. Is Rashmi competitive? Uh, I mean, any deck can be competitive. It just depends on like, how commander central you want to be. And Mike B he seems like blue green can be very competitive. Michael B. Now what, Michael? I'll play land. Wow, she just played Ovenwall Tracker and attacked with it? What a maniac. Fighting. We could have actually played Joyra there. You understand? Do you understand, Michael? Do you understand? Do you understand? Is this deck running top? <laughs> Is this deck... It's right here. No. Is our deck running top? What's our deck? Do you label your decks by letters? Oh, that person finally conceded? Did they? That's great. Oh, look. We get to go. It's just me and Wozier again. Hold on. I guess I'll let this resolve. Do, 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 do. It's just me and Wozier just hanging out. What if Wozier's like, yeah, I'll just... Oh, we got to do the thing. Hold on, guys. Give me one second. I'm, I'm going to play this out. Do I care? I'm just going to cancel. Right? I'm just going to concede. Right? Who cares? You won. You would have won. All right. Yeah, Wozier, you got it. You got it. Wozier walks away the winner because he outlasted all of us. Is there a competitive commander? Yeah, it's called 1v1, you stupid dick face. Your face looks like a dick. <laughs> <laughs> like, come on, my dude. I totally did. I totally conceded to Wozier. Wozier's like, I don't even know what's happening, man. I just left. Like an adult. You know, like a like not a child. I wanted to land here, Michael. But there was no land to be had. We can go Opal, this, this, Joyra. And win the game. Before we die. We just need to land here. The problem with Opal is we need two lands, basically. <coughs> 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 
You could play Chromosphere and sack it. Chromosphere? Yeah. A Chromosphere? Well, if that's the case, I feel like I should just play Petal and Opal, too. Because then I can actually get an activation off this. What? <laughs> what, what, what? I said jerk. What's... You, yeah, conceded the person not being... I said J-E-R-K. We're just going to do it, Michael. Are you ready? I'm just going to do it. I'm going to get a blue and a red. Do, 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 do. His metal worker. Maybe I'll just play metal worker here. How do you feel about that? Sure. Do you like my metal worker, Michael? Is it each planet? Target opponent. Okay. I got you, fam. Give me the spear. She asked twice, so I'm like, gotta have it. Gotta do it then. Sure. Metal worker. Work that metal, you little bastard. <laughs> Wow. Wowie zowie. You know? What was that thing you said? Like, like, it was just a stupid rhyme. It was the dumbest rhyme ever. Like, I can't think of it, but it's it's literally in my head all the time. Like, wowie bowie, give, give Mikey this. I don't know. It was something weird, man. It was a really weird, like, stupid rhyme, and it made no sense. But <sighs> it was did it have to do with the mommy salami thing? Maybe. Yeah, I don't know. Like, Jesus. What do you want from me, man? I just want some answers, Michael. He killed your metal worker. Yeah, he's a monster. He's history's greatest monster. He also killed my spirit. Now you're basically dead. See, if we had lightning greaves, this wouldn't be an issue, my dude. Michael. Salami to your mommy? Oh, did you not hear about this, Bulawag? Michael said he's got the salami for your mommy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Christ. Are you attacking me after I gave you the token? That's that's rude AF. You need Jesus, Sarah. We can't do anything, right? Does this get a land? Kind of. Uh, we can go this, this, get a land, right? I feel like that's probably better than not doing that. Come and Josh on our door. Gonna make mana too. All right, come on. This time Josh gets it. You can't have any more tokens. You've ruined your your token privileges have been. I feel like these pain lands and spear lands are not necessary. I feel like this could be mana confluence, right? That's just better unless there already is one. But I definitely agree with you. I think your colors are fine. But my mommy is vegetarian. Does Mike offer vegetarian? Yeah, give that vegetarian salami to your mommy. Morning star salami for your mommy. Morning star. No blocks. Morningstar sausages are friggin' delicious, though. They just taste like real sausages. Sausages. Real sausages. Oh, 
Oh my god, this is just disgusting. She's really holding us down here. Don't do me like that. Oh, baby, 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 baby. If she actually darted one of these, we could have retracted it. Yeah, you got to be able to cast your creature. I think this deck wants more land, I'll be honest. I yeah. think you want at least one more land in here. Like, it's really crucial for you to hit four mana. It's really all you care about. I'm going to pass here. Are we going to go 2-1? This is unbelievable. I wonder if Channel is legal in Commander. Probably not, right? I feel like it's banned. I'm pretty sure it is. You can double check, but I think it is illegal. Michael, shut the hell up. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, fifteen. Fifteen damage. So we actually literally have to go off next turn or else we're dead. Oh, maybe not. Well, that's sad. Get a two drop. So time for creature coverage, remember equal to the number of verse counters on Yisan. So one drop. Aquarian Ranger. Return a forest, untap a creature, sure. You can bounce this dude, untap your Marwin. I just want to land off the top for my salami. Actually, really, that doesn't even do anything because we have to play the zero drop to turn on Mox Opal again. Are there artifact lands in here? Or is this like Seed of the, Se 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 of the Synod and... They probably should be in here if they're not. Oh, those are great additions that we could just easily put in here. Seat. Uh, what's the red one? Great Furnace? I think so. Seat and Furnace. I'll take out two islands here. Um, Citadel? I mean, these are all just great because they turn on your your dude. Yeah. How are these not in here? That's crazy. Yeah, Mana Confluence is definitely better than... Because they can't tap your Mana Confluence and have you take damage. It's not... It's not it's supremely better, edge. but it's just... Yeah, it's just a little bit better. No blocks. No blocks. You dead. We are dead. Yeah, I think I think Josh killed us. If, if our metal workers survived, this would be a completely different game. This deck definitely seems like it wants more lands. Did Josh leave? Is he still playing? I can't even tell. You guys are you guys are on your own now. Return to the game. Return to the game. I was dead. <laughs> I was dead on board. That was narcissism. Like you have one, two, you have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, forty, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. You have twenty power. I mean, I conceded because I'm dead. <laughs> Uh, QBTA, probably do one more command around. Put this bad boy closer to two hours, and then uh, we'll do a... You still down for some cubes? You got your nap in? Can I do a nug run? Yeah, for sure. Get them nugs in, boy. I can tell you're eating some raisins. I can tell the hunger is getting to you. Mm. Need a good nug run. You can even you can eat on stream, too. People, you guys you guys are ready to watch Michael eat some nuggets? What sauce should I get, guys? I'm a big fan of barbecue sauce. Go in the comment for... Nuggets. For sauce options. Can we get some sauce boats here? 
Some McDonald's chicken McNugget sauce votes. Honey mustard. No, that's a good one. You mean honey busket? Mm -hmm. How do you feel about sweet and sour? Sweet and sour reminds me of just Asian food. I just feel like I'm eating sweet and sour chicken when I dunk nuggets and sweet what's, and sour what's sauce. What's wrong with that? I guess nothing, but I don't know if that's the sauce I'm looking for. Just honey in general, not even honey mustard. Put that mustard in that honey. Yeah, uh, the Szechuan sauce, that's not really a thing you can get anymore, so. Life isn't fair, Michael. <laughs> Oh, man. Is honey an offering? Do they just offer honey? I imagine they just have honey packets for, like, tea or whatever. I don't think Szechuan... I think you guys are overestimating the uh, Szechuan sauce availability at McDonald's. It literally doesn't exist. Well, they no, gave they it to like they re-released it though. Only to like celebrities. Yeah, maybe that's true. No, I thought they had it in the in the packs for a little while. No. No. I wish I could get rid of myself so I can make these guys bigger. I don't need to be mono monopolizing all this room here. I uh, can see the game. I did that already. <laughs> Why would they let me do it again? You can concede as much as you want. How do I send a pic of Szechuan sauce I got from my local market? Basically upload it to like Imager and then post it here. I would ask. I'd be like, you guys got that Szechuan sauce? And they'll be like, yeah, hold on. And you'll be like, wow, I've wasted so much time. People were definitely camping out. You ain't kidding. Wow, that's messed up. Tell them you're an internet celebrity. You do have a fan fiction. Well, that's true. Haven't you heard of my fan fiction? All right, we did it. We did it. Okay, so we've made some changes here, which I like. I would add at least one land. I like that, too. Cut literally anything. Probably an island. Add to wish list. No, man. Are there any we're missing? We have... Steam Vents, Volcanic, Shivan Reef. Where's the Spire Bluff? Where's the Spire Bluff Canal? Painland? It's right here. Shivan Reef. No, no, no. The, um... The Ravnica Duel. Was that in here? Steam Vents. Okay. Shockland. Just making sure. Yeah, Shockland. That yeah, way. we'll put Spire Bluff Canal in here. Because, like... It's, if you control three or fewer, two or fewer lands that comes to play on tap, like that's most of the time. Ooh, reflecting pool seems good too. Like every land is just going to tap for one or one of the other colors, so I would probably cut. Probably just cut one of the fetch lands, maybe. Not for reflecting pool. You're only two colors. I don't think you need reflecting pool. Okay, you win. Okay, does that make you happy? What about forbidden orchard? I actually don't like giving them tokens. Yeah, it's usually not relevant. I feel like reflecting pool is probably just better though. Okay. Maybe not. I don't know. If you draw island reflecting pool, it's rough, I guess. I don't know. We'll just we'll just keep the orchard in there. I guess that's fine. What are we cutting here? Literally anything? Uh probably one of the bigger spells. Well, not this, not this, not this, not this, not this. Uh what about Bribery's purse. That seems. Oh wait, this is zero. zero. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm not super c convinced about fade away, but maybe it's just a wrath effect if they tap out. Yeah, but you're fast enough. I don't think that matters. I. I it's probably just a one drop. Or boomerang, maybe, because it's cost two. Yeah, I can see cutting boomerang. And it's double blue as well, which has been pretty rough. Like, yeah, I well, the only reason I like boomerang is because you can get it with mystical tutor, which if they like have a lock piece out, it's relevant. Like something you need to bounce, right? Yeah. Also, Boomerang can bounce your own drawer to save her. Which might be relevant. Well, and Summon could too. Yeah, Boomerang's more versatile. I'll put Boomerang back in. God, we just took it out. Unbelievable. <laughs> 
I'll use this f- this weird <laughs> one. <laughs> My body. My little devil. <laughs> all right, now cut any one drop. That's what I was thinking. I mean, like, they're all pretty... just burp again yeah oh god it's still terrible man <laughs> really it's it's got a lot of there's a high concentration of coffee in there shelf your library uh we can actually equip this guy though so i'm, I'm reluctant to get a creature probably picks this of pandemonium that seems fine all right we're gonna do one more guys are you ready if i'm ready if they song of dryad joyra you need boomerang or you well you could use that turns into a forest, doesn't it? Yeah. 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 Yes. Yeah. Oh, we're just doing it again. We're doing we're doing the time doing the time warp again. Pre nug burp. Yeah, he's gotta get he's gotta make room for all those nugs. Wait, what? Wait. Oh, okay, I was like, wait, why is he down here? That doesn't make any sense. Ooh, Tesa. Get a taste of these. This is this good. Hand is gas. This is this is turn two Joyra, and then we can hold this and and play it. Ooh. Oh, that also draws you a card. This this gas. Is it? Oh, it might be whenever you cast. Actually, that might change things. What's it say? Whenever you cast. Okay. Dang, that sucks. Good luck. Have fun, Narcissus. You're right. Whoa, you're still alive. No, I went off and then I came back. Went off and then I came back. Do, 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 Uh, no, keep him. Snapping and keeping. Snapping and keeping. All right, let's look at, let's look at Felix's, uh, Felix's nugs. Apparently there was an error. Is that link correct? Because it's not, it's not working. Oh, that's down. Let's see if we can finagle it. Oh, but that's just regular spice. No, I didn't. We didn't. I didn't mean like Szechuan sauce you buy at the store. I mean like official McDonald's Szechuan yeah, sauce. Yeah, there's McDonald's variety. That uh, we're not. We didn't play first, right? Is it our turn? Turn one. Bane. Where? Who's? Where am I? Is it my turn? Turn one. Bane. But ours is lit. I don't know what's going on. I guess they're just done. Okay, that's good. That that's fine. Do you think anyone's gonna kill if we get a volcanic island? Do you think anyone's gonna wasteland us? Please let me know asking for a friend. Look at this, we got two card draws right after. What is the purpose of this deck? It'll it'll fucking kill you. If you'd like to know what this deck does, it draws a bunch of cards and storms out. You know what else it does? It takes the salami for your mommy. Super Fritz, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Really appreciate it. Welcome back. Okay. Okay. They don't know they're dead, do they? <laughs> hey, look. You don't even have to go searching. Remember how Soul Ring is one of those broken cards in Magic the Gathering? My name is Frank of Horn. I can afford Aramaces for my commander decks. My commander net decks kill it you cannot you'll be dead let me get a mox opal I can get it every game this is no different look at a card you may draw a card at the beginning of the next turn's upkeep oh dang it we only got one more shot you ready I will also take like a mana oh shit I think we just died I don't know if we died. Yeah, no, we're probably dead here. Didn't you see us whiff? We're totally dead. This is a 3-3. They can kill it. I played a turn one Pluto Delta into Underground Seed the other day, and the whole table turned on me for playing. Wow, that's... Magic players are so weird, dude. Please watch your language requesting for a friend. Okay, Orzov's saying that's fine. That seems... Yeah, people are like, oh, you can't have expensive lands. It's like, buddy. It's commander, buddy. The last thing I want to do is not be able to cast my spells because I'm using all cheap-ass lands. Come on, one time, one time, one time. You got this one time, one time, one time. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Don't die, 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 don't die
What does that thing even do? Uh, you sack it, you look at a, all of random card in their hand, look at a random card in target player's hand, you draw a card. I just want the card draw, obviously. Oh my god, they didn't... Oh god, we're just gonna win? Now, we're, now, now there's no way we lose, right? Like, this is just over, right? Uh, I guess we'll see. It's just over, right, Michael? We can copy artifact the soul ring. You could. You could do whatever you like. Are you watching what's happening? This is a fun and inter interactive magic, the gathering game. False. <laughs> We can attack with uh, Joyra as well. Deal all that commander damage that I've, that I've heard so much about. D -d 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 that guy's good. So we can go one, uh, two, uh, three. Let's inspect the foundry, my dude. Are they going to counter this? Can you imagine? Can you imagine? I can only imagine. Oh god, what's he doing? What are you Kept doing? To command. Dismiss. Man, you got dismissed, bro. I feel really bad about that, actually. I still get to draw a card. Still good. Still good. Still good. <sighs> get a little. Get a little nervous now. I really wanted a discounty. You can pedal. Pedal what? You can make a mana. Well, I can just play a land, too. That doesn't work. Playing a land doesn't work? Oh, never mind. <laughs> I'm just saying play a land, man. We can also just equip this on here so it's safer, but... Hey, man. Gotta risk it for the biscuit. One time, one time, one time. Unsummon. Beautiful. That's beautiful. Wow. Let's go blue and play Tell Jihad Stylus. We got command tower. Alright, I think we're done here, right? Did you attack? I just uh Sarah. Because she was attacking me last game, even though I uh gave her spirit tokens. That was pretty rude. Which one? She attacking you with your own spirit. Right? Uh oh, that's terrifying. Your voice sounds a little off. Do you have a cold? Ask no. What? No. What's wrong with you? Oh, we could have cracked this and drew another card. God, man, magic's so hard. There's so many things going on. There's so many things that don't do anything going on. I'm gonna be real sad if they kill this. Okay, that's fine. That doesn't do anything. Okay, that's good. We're doing good. You can unsummon it. I can unsummon. Thank you. Your mommy. <laughs> Pleboosh, thank you so much for the reset, buddy. Welcome back. Really. But for what purpose would you unsummon my mommy? To give her the salami. <laughs> okay. Nailed it. Preordain. That's good for us. What did they do? Put two on the bottom? They're digging. They are digging. Opponent preordains, put two on the bottom. Nice. I'm like, yes, you are. I was actually thinking about Spark Double to copy the Joyra. Because I kept looking at this Metamorph and I'm like, would Spark Double be real good here? Oh, this is it. We're done. What does that do? Nothing. It doesn't impact us in any way. It's it's shared animosity. Whenever a creature you control attacks, it gets plus one for each other creature that shares a type with it. Hmm. But you can do whatever you like, really. What does Inventor Share do again? At the beginning of your upkeep, you control three or more artifacts, gain a life, or you can pay four and tap it uh, if you have Metalcraft to search your library for an artifact. That seems good. That does seem good. Zero. Zero man artifact. Oh, that's it. That'll do. That will do, La Pig. They call him Michael La Pig. Yeah, I'll pay two life here. Ba -dum -boom 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 -boom. All right, so. We're just bouncing it all, right? Mm -hmm. I want it all. And I'm gonna bounce it now. Cast it. Everybody's tapped out. One, 
Atuhu. Okay. Let me play them zero boys. Okay. I don't want to use that yet because we can probably get colorless and I want to save the... Gotta see what we're getting at the end here. Do we play land this turn? Yeah, we, we search for the... Nope. Zero. Zero. I think I see another zero down. Oh, Candelabra seems good. No, it doesn't. It just seems mediocre here, I guess. Serious question if you're not busy playing Solitaire. Shoot. Can we play Popper sometime? Okay. Deal. Okay, hold on. We're not playing that. Or are we? Probably want to play Solar Ring. Just let your soul ring. Yeah, that's what I was going with that. But I want to keep the blue up. I think the blue is way more important than the... Got a zero? No, just a one. We're running out, man. This is not good. Is there anything busted we can get here? Am I missing any busted interactions here? Honey busket interactions? <sighs> this guy scries, I guess. Come on, Hercules Recall. Transmute. That's not what Daddy wants. Nope. I don't have the mana for that, but I do like it. You should definitely keep that. You'd be insane not to. Right, but like we're trying to do it this turn, right? So we need one more mana? We're not going to go off this turn. How dare you talk to me like this? <laughs> <laughs> Why not? Why can't we? Because we're bottlenecked on the mana. We're bottlenecked on mana. Let's just copy Soaring. It's basically free at this point. But what does that do? Don't bottom it. Don't do it. All right, I'm going to trust you, but we have to, like... If Joyra dies, then we're just dead anyway, right? She didn't die last turn. What makes you think she's going to die this turn? Because they drew an extra card. Oh, they drew an extra card. Oh, my God, they drew an extra card. Oh, Q, 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 Yeah, copy the Soaring. You should probably do that. Just let your soul glow, okay? Buddy, I've let my soul glow for my entire life. You look what that got you. <laughs> what is that supposed to mean? I don't know. I just wanted to say it. How dare you? Look, we got that cloud key. How much does that thing cost? Three. God, what a ripoff. Too damn much. Oh, wow. I, we drew this right now with no mana, so now we have to discard a bunch of stuff. Wait, don't we have spellbook out? Never mind. I'll pass the turn. I don't actually know how to kill with Joyra. I just know how to complain about the combo turns. Well, that's the thing, isn't it? All right. Fingers crossed that we don't lose our Joyra. Fingeals crossed. We haven't lost her yet. We get to draw Seed of Synod, which doesn't do much actually now that I've realized it's cast, but that's still fine. It's still an artifact land. It actually might be worse now because it bounces when you have. Yeah, these are actually worse now because they're not you're not casting them. Wait, no, they work for Metalcraft though too, so yeah, that is that's, relevant. that's relevant. Yeah, I guess so. Because usually you're going to tap them before you go off anyway. So. But one thing I noticed that is kind of a problem is, I think you need more basics for your fetches. You mean salamis for my mommies? Yeah, salamis for your mommies. That's what you need. That's what father likes. It's pleasant how your rebuild to draw 10 also bounce the Alundra player back to the... I know, I thought that too. I was like... You said into the storage, but I think you meant Stone Age. Is it our turn again? Oh, wow, they're dead. The, this time, for sure, right? Play the cloud key and this game's over. I don't want to waste red. I don't like wasting colored mana when I don't have to. That's not what Father likes. Yeah, that resolves. This game's over. Oh. Oh. 
That's still going to replay it. Yeah, I know. I know, Michael. Replay it. Play it again. <laughs> I swear if you don't replay it, boy. We play land, too. Like Michael told me to play lands. Well, they command Someone tower. has to let me. I don't even want to get that because I don't think we're going to find anything. Play the command tower. Okay. God. Gorb. Great Gorble Borbles. Great Gorble Borbles is what Michael just said. Do you like when I call you Michael or do you like Mike or what's the what's the preferred nomenclature? Milosh. Milosh. <laughs> oh, Crack Clan Ironworks? Sure. Is this what it feels like to die? This is what it feels like for you to die. Return an artifact from your grave reader hand. No. It does nothing. This costs three and we only have two up, right? For now. I guess we could just kind of keep digging. Oh. Okay. Um, so we can go one, two. This costs two and a Phyrexian mana. So we can go one, two mana more. One, two mana for a soul ring. And that's just, we just break even there. Okay. Solitaire time, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, we're just gonna draw. Oh, we're just gonna draw retract here, I guess. Oh, or we can draw steel springleaf drum. I guess that seems like it's probably just gonna do the same thing. Okay, we only have fifty-two cards in our deck though, so we gotta be careful. <laughs> okay, so we go springleaf drum. Tap it for a blue. One, two. Rock Clan Iron Workums. Yowza. Cast this Mox Opal. Cast Barb Sexy Time. This card has sex in the title, Michael. That's inappropriate. This guy's just going to die, right? That's fine. Still draws your card. Okay, you say it's fine, but it's just because you're really cruel and you don't really believe in Hangerback Walkers. I don't. It's messed up, man. All right, so what we're going to do is... <sighs> Transmute Artifact can get us either Vibbidi Bop. We don't have colored mana. Don't we, though? We have one colored mana here, and we have a Mox Opal. Okay, we do it. <clears throat> Pay one. Okay, so that's only one colored mana. That's unfortunate. Oh, add one the, man of any color. Sure. Just use the card work. No, that's the same. Right, but... Oh, yeah, we're... Yeah, I'm an idiot. There we go. Sack. This thing. Sack. This thing. Add a blue. Add a blue. Transmute. We'll sacrifice Tormod's Crypt to get... Brrr, Aetherflux Reservoir... Pay four? Okay. Sacrifice an artifact. Cornucopia. Sacrifice an artifact. This thing. Pay four? Yes. I accept. Let's play hanger back for zero. Uh, Adjust. Let's go to zero. There okay. Go. Done. We're at 35. Let's see how much life we gain from this. 16 seems good I guess we'll gain 17 from this now so we should go to theoretically uh, 68 I have to put all these count these triggers on the stack is the correct 68 Jesus 68 Jesus 60 minutes if you don't want to play it out let me know and I'll scoop otherwise I'll let you do your thing yeah definitely this is the best part of the deck, right? I mean, not for everyone else. This is just literally Storm and Vintage Cube as well. And if you guys haven't done so, definitely check out MeUndies.com slash Frank Lepore. You'll get 15% off along with free shipping and free returns. And then we'll shoot Sarah in the face. And then she did. And then we shoot Josh in the face. And then he did. 
So we're actually uh three one and the only the only match loss we had was when we couldn't draw our lands. This deck seems ridiculously unfun. I don't think there's any improvements that can be made because it actually just seems sweet, but we did make some. And I actually feel like it's pretty decent. I think you could probably fit Spark Mage in here somewhere, but the Metamorph being an artifact and the copy artifact costing two is pretty relevant. But it is a, it is a consideration because then you're drawing two cards a turn with Joyra instead. Um, but yeah, deck was sweet. Ash, thank you so much for letting me play this deck. I'm sorry about the, the delay, but Mike was feeling sick and he seems to be doing a lot better now, actually. And um, this... <laughs> this i think this deck was super fun just because of all of the uh the ensuing craziness that happened with the people yelling at us and us the first round where we're just like oh this is ridiculous <clears throat> so yeah this was really sweet i would not mind uh i would not mind playing this in paper commander and then just <laughs> wow really be a make hater. you'd play this no i probably wouldn't but i would i think i'd play it for the memes and then i'd be like okay i'd retire that'd be my commander retirement and then I'd be like, I'm good. Thank you, guys. Thank you guys for watching, though. If you're uh, watching on YouTube or watching on Twitch, we're not leaving, though. We're just going to uh, end the YouTube video. But thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. Send those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out at manatraders.com, which is where I borrowed, actually, a lot of these cards on Magic Online from. And with promo code and link in the description, you will get 20% off the first three months of any subscription. So definitely check those guys out. They uh, run a great site. And... Uh, I'll see you next time, guys. If you want to have your own deck critiqued, check out my info. It's in the Twitch page description or my YouTube description. And uh, I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Really appreciate it.